The royal will be celebrating his next birthday soon with a substantial fortune from his late great-grandmother, while the rest of us are lucky if we get 10 pounds in a lucky charm. After her death in 2002 at the age of 101, the Queen Mother took many steps to guarantee that her immense wealth would pass on to her family. According to the Times, thanks to these agreements before her death, the Duke of Sussex will be having a particularly big payday when he celebrates a milestone birthday in September. The 39-year-old father of two will inherit more than just family treasures, as he's poised to receive a fraction of the Queen Mother's estimated £70 million fortune that she placed into a trust fund for her family. In fact, it's been rumored he'll receive a massive £7 million share of the profits when he gets 40. What's more, it's projected to be a higher portion of the extraordinarily high inheritance pot than his older brother, the Prince of Wales, according to the financial arrangements within the family. Even though he's clearly had a lengthy wait on his hands, it's still a lovely small gift to get 20 years after her death. But Christopher Anderson, author of The King, feels there's a very solid explanation for the four-decade delay. He told Fox News, Why 40? To a lady who nearly lived to be 102, one can only assume that 40 seemed like the perfect age to come into some extra income, when you're young enough to appreciate it but yet old enough and hopefully intelligent enough not to blow it. Of course, the prince's great granny couldn't have anticipated all the trouble the Duke of Sussex caused the rest of the family. In my opinion, if she had known, she would have removed him from the trust completely. As for why the Duke of Sussex is going to receive more than his brother, podcaster Kinsey Schofield feels this boils down to something as straightforward. Schofield, who runs the To D for Daily podcast, told the outlet, The Duke is set to collect more money than the Prince of Wales because he is the spare. The heir and the spare being a popular expression to refer to the child who would inherit a title or estate, and the backup heir. The Queen Mother knew he would have fewer opportunities and responsibilities. It was a sensible and considered decision. There will be no tensions as the family knew about this arrangement for decades. Two summers ago, when he reached 40, the Prince of Wales probably quietly acquired his share. What are your thoughts on this? Let me see them in the comments. Thanks and have a nice day.